muscles, muscles, muscles. Over the years we've had some great bodybuilders turned actors and in this week's video we're counting down the top 10 best bodybuilders turned actors. Follow the yellow brick road. Before we continue with the video, I publish videos every Friday, Saturday and Sunday, so please remember to click like and subscribe so you can be the first to know as soon as I post new videos. Now let's get back to the video. Sergio Ciani, better known as Alan Steele, was an Italian bodybuilder and actor. I actually had to go make sure I pronounce the name correctly. Sergio Ciani. So, I hope it's great. He started his career as a stuntman and also as a body double for Steve Reeves, standing in for Reeves in the 1959 Hercules Unchained, before getting a small part in another Steve Reeves film, The Giant of Marathon. Who would have thought that Steve Reeves needs a stunt double? Samson calls upon all his magnificent strength. All you'd have to do is reach out a hand and take me by the throat. Paolo Young is a former competitive bodybuilder and actor, internationally known for his roles in movies like Bloodsport and Enter the Dragon. He started his bodybuilding career at the tender age of 10. And oddly enough, if it wasn't for Winston Cigarettes, we might have never seen him in movies. It was while filming a commercial for Winston Cigarettes that he was made by Bruce Lee, who got him a role in the movie Enter the Dragon. Peter Looper started his career by winning multiple bodybuilding competitions, including Mr. Indianapolis, Mr. Indiana, Mr. Hercules, and Mr. International Health. Like so many other bodybuilders from the 1960s, he followed in the footsteps of Steve Reeves and ventured into the peplum film craze of the 60s. Go, go. Hey, two acres of human flesh. <laughs> Thanks, Willie. These things cost me money. That's the fifth bag you ruined this week. Sorry, Charlie. Uh, work out on the small bag there. Come on. Come on. Come on. He is best known for starring in the TV series Mission Impossible. Did you know that he posed for Playgo magazine in 1974? Did you own a copy of that issue? Do you still have that copy of the issue? Let me know in the comments. The Paul brothers, bodybuilding twins Peter and David Paul, started their acting career in 1983 and had a successful career in acting throughout the 80s and early 90s. The duo became an international hit upon the release of the 1987 film, The Barbarians, which has since garnered a cult following due to its silly but fun premise. Nevertheless, they remained rebellious and unbroken. And they grew until they were men. But not ordinary men. Barbarians. The Hungarian bodybuilder Miki Hargitay won the 1955 Mr. Universe competition before starting his acting career in 1957's Both Success Pearl Rock Hunter. This hunk of He-Man is Hu Yi Fu from Hong Kong. The amateur winner is Miki Hargitay, while the professional champion is Leo Robert of Canada, Mr. Universe of 1955. He also portrayed Hercules as so many other bodybuilders. I wonder if his physique had anything to do with it. Vittorioso nelle più spettacolari imprese impossibili ad esseri umani. Impersonato dall'attore Mickey Hargitay. In 1980, Arnold Schwarzenegger portrayed Hargitay in the made for TV film The Jane Mansfield Story. It has also been called one of the most enjoyable bad movies you'll ever watch. Branaganski, The Jungle Man. What did Rita tell you about her new boyfriend? Well, she calls him her lover doll. I don't mind that. President of one of those advertising places with all the names like they can't make up their minds. Lou Ferrigno, Lou Ferrigno is considered by many to be the best Hulk in TV and cinema history. He also portrayed legendary heroes Hercules and Sinbad. You help Calm me. down. Calm down and I shall help. They thought I was dead, but they took my friend Urania with them. Who took her? The slime people. They ambushed us. They rise out of the mud and mire and hold you by suction. Where did they go? Through the wild. 
Arnold Schwarzenegger was also in the running to play Hulk in the TV series, but he lost out to Ferrigno. Something else Ferrigno beat Arnold Schwarzenegger to, as well as other bodybuilders, was that he was named the youngest person to ever win the Mr. Universe competition, winning the competition when he was only 20 years old. Hercules, the incredible Lou Ferrigno, is Hercules. In a battle with unearthly creatures, Hercules, the superhuman hero, with the strength of an army. Mark Forrest wasn't just a bodybuilder and actor like everybody else on his list, but he was also an accomplished opera singer. Though he also auditioned to portray Tarzan, he unfortunately never got cast in the role of Tarzan, but he garnered international fame in his role as Hercules. Who are you? What do you want here? This is my land. If it's yours, defend it. Take him! <laughs> 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 he starred in several peplum films throughout the 60s until he ultimately decided to leave acting behind and pursue a singing career as an opera singer. Unfortunately, I couldn't get any clips of him singing opera, but just take my word for it, he's a good opera singer. Coming in at number 3, the handsome Reg Park, who only made 5 films throughout his acting career. But his 5 Hercules films sure left a mark on cinema history. He even served as inspiration as well as mentor for Arnold Schwarzenegger. When he was 42 years old, he faced off against Arnold Schwarzenegger in the 1970 Mr. Universe bodybuilding competition, losing to Schwarzenegger who came in at first place. And British publisher ex-sergeant instructor Reg Park is acclaimed the man with the best developed body in the world. Since a small boy he is trained to be champion. Now, in his magazine universe, he advises all young bodybuilders how they too can muscle in and maybe become Mr. Universe themselves. An 18 and a half inch collar gives an impression of Reggie's tremendous arm muscles, another champion in the 1951 British tradition. Steve Reeves has been featured on this channel so many times, I don't think there's anything I can tell you about him that you don't already know. Reeves was always destined for greatness as he survived many near-death experiences as a child, including being run over by a car and being dragged several feet, being thrown off a horse as a child, and even sleeping through an earthquake. Yes, you heard correct, he slept through an earthquake. When he was unaccounted for, his family members went searching for him in the house and found him asleep in his bed moments before the house collapsed. What are you doing here? I just can't keep my mind on my workouts. At dinner? You've been avoiding me lately, and I'm off of acid and electricity. Well, you just tell Grandpa to give you a steam bath. And stop thinking. It always upsets you. Arnold Schwarzenegger probably had the most successful acting career of all bodybuilders when they left bodybuilding behind to pursue acting. Schwarzenegger performed most of his own stunts in his films, as it proved very difficult to find stunt doubles that could match his size. Not even other bodybuilders could match Arnold Schwarzenegger's size. He started his bodybuilding career as a teen, but struggled to build up mass in his calves, resulting in townsfolks teasing him and calling him the muscle boy with chicken legs. Nothing gave way, and they all lumbered into position for a final once-over by the experts. The choice was an American as amateur Mr. Universe and an Austrian as the professional. Do you agree that Arnold Schwarzenegger belongs at number one on this list? Let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed this video, please remember to click like and subscribe. For a similar video to this one, click on this link.